हेलो गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल प्रिंस ऑटोमेशन डेस्टिनेशन सो इन आर वेब ड्राइवर मैनेजर सीरीज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड ऑन हाउ वी कैन यूज वेब ड्राइवर मैनेजर एज अ मिडल मैन टू डाउनलोड द रिस्पेक्टिव ड्राइवर एग्जीक्यूटिवल्स इन द सिस्टम ओके सो सपोज वी हैव अ सिस्टम और ओ एस विंडोज ओ एस हैविंग क्रोम फायर बुक्स एंड एज ब्राउजर इंस्टॉल्ड सो वेब ड्राइवर मैनेजर कैन मैनेज डाउनलोडिंग द ड्राइवर फ्रॉम Chrome driver location, similarly Gecko driver and Edge driver. So these drivers are responsible for execution of UI automation test cases. Okay, so we have Chrome browser installed, but it needs internally a driver to trigger the execution of the browser. Okay, so this is what we have discussed in the previous lecture. I'll be sharing that in I icon. Okay, so now what we are going to discuss about. So there is a new feature in Web Driver Manager, uh, the Docker browser concept. wherein we can execute our test cases in docker without the complication of downloading or pulling the docker images and setting up everything okay so now moving on to the code side what i'm going to do right now so if you look at it previously we were using line number 19 to download the driver and setting it up internally now what we need to do we need to create web driver manager dot cram from driver dot browser in docker so this is new concept or new method introduced in latest versions of uh, web driver manager okay so if you hover over uh, web browser in manager its return type is web driver manager that's why i have created object of web driver manager right now we don't need to follow the rest of the steps i'm removing line number 19 right because i'm not going to set up locally okay now what i need to do uh, from this object web driver manager what i need to do i need to click create right uh, and this is how i can set up yeah before we move on let me show you uh, like what is needed so first of all you need to install docker for windows in your machine this is the requirement in 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 case of executing the test cases in docker browser okay or using the web driver manager okay so i'll be sharing this particular url and if you go to the web driver manager official document you see browsers in docker this is introduced as part of web driver manager 5. Dot some series 5 plus series right now i have 5.4.1 but there is a launch of 5.5.0 as well into the market okay so this is what i have done so what i'm doing i'm now executing this case in browser in docker in case you won't be having this uh, docker installed in your machine then it will launch the application locally okay launch the chrome in the local system but now i'm using browser in docker so you won't see the execution here instead the execution will take place in the docker so you will see that all steps will be taking place so i have triggered the execution let us see so it is taking time so you see driver is launched and validated successfully okay in case you are doubtful where exactly it is testing it is executing the test cases so let me show you uh, an option by which we can even view the execution so you need to provide enable uh, vnc if you will provide this then after after creation of this object what you need to do web driver manager dot uh i need to get uh, get uh, docker no vnc url its return type is url so i'll be getting it into the url okay i'm importing the url dependency and uh, putting it like that so i'm now debugging it right to show you the execution so first of all i'll get this url to make you aware that it is really executing in docker so i have triggered the execution in uh, debug mode so that i can get the url this is for the purpose of validation that execution is really taking in taking place in docker so if you look at it i have got this url what i'm going to do now i'm going to copy it i am now going to this okay and if i for example click on this what will happen i'll be able to log in into the vnc so you see so far the driver has uh, uh, launched now what i'm going to do i am now going to resume the execution so 
moving on to the execution so you see the execution is now taking place within the system so it has launched source demo it will now enter username and password as per the flow and uh, then it will log in so let us see whether it is working or not okay it got stuck because of the breakpoint let me resume it once more i am now moving on okay so this is how you can launch the execution in the docker browser okay the foremost and uh, main thing required is you should have docker installed in your local system so in case you want to read more about how this browser and things are working i'll be sharing this particular url with you web driver manager official documentation and you can get more understanding from here thank you for now bye